the, the military junta in the uh, Niger, uh, Niger Republic, mm -hmm. uh, the former uh, Nigerian head of state says, said uh, that he met with them and he has uh, given his message uh, to the president. And he said, made one statement. He said, no one wants war. And also, the AU has suspended. But I'm worried about the suspension of the AU because I thought if you're going to enter into negotiation with somebody, somebody who is a member, and if you're suspending him, you have closed the door of negotiation. So probably you just look for another party to negotiate because why would I negotiate with the man who has suspended me? Well, I, I think, um, I mean, in my um, humble opinion, mm -hmm. it's in line to suspend the uh, Republic of Niger in the mm -hmm. circumstance. Mm -hmm. Because I don't, I, 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 I'm scared. Sorry, before you continue, to... have you ever heard where UN suspends its member? Well, I, I, I not, not in any Maybe recent we should history. reflect why not... Africa is always doing that. There are a lot of infractions. I've never had the UN will say we suspend a member because we want to deal with the member. But in this case, the ECOWAS, you know, and the AU, you know, they, they have some kinds of convention to say at no point will the continent allow military intervention mm -hmm. in, in governance. Mm -hmm. And Niger is a signatory to that convention. I agree with you. I'm also yes. saying that somebody once said, he said, why not also have some targeted sanction instead of the entire yeah, country? Instead of, instead uh, Russia invaded, mm -hmm. despite the UN had issued statement against that, they've they not, suspended not suspended Russia. Russia. Mm -hmm. Because it's not about Russia now. Mm -hmm. They rather promote targeted sanctions. So probably this is what AU Equus will begin to look at, that making the entire people suffer, whether they agree with the military junta or not. But, but you see, my mind is that while the issues of whether they should be suspended or not, Hood's way, the fact is that even the, 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 the military guys who effected this uh, uh, coup aren't helping matters. Mm. As, of, as I speak to you now, this morning, there are some machineries coming from Russia. They have, they have arrived in the Niger Republic Thank as we speak. You. Apparently to come and equip no, what they and said, get no, ready. What they said is that they have come on the invitation of the government to help tackle uh, hey. ter terrorists. <laughs> <laughs> and, 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 we know the terrorists. I'll call the statement. Know. Terrorists and other interests. Uh, hey. Thank oh, you. Other interests. Those, that those, is were, the, that is those, those were the... So, so could it also be a reaction to the standby force? Oh, definitely. What are they reacting to? That's what I'm saying. That They are also not helping matters. If you are saying you want peace... Our, um, um, the, the ECOWAS uh, team that went to mediate had come out to say nobody wants war. Mm. All right, you are saying we believe in democratic means of resolving these issues. Mm. And you are importing mm. foreign powers to come and probably coach you or fight on your behalf. They are not pretending that they are Russian mercenaries, clearly written. So Russia is also trying to send a message. Remember Russia so, has so, won So we are, we are won gradually ECOWAS. bringing in the proxy war we won the games earlier. No, no, they've been in Mali all this while. Mm -hmm. They have a base in Mali. They have a base yes. in Burkina Faso. Yes. So they've been around all this while. They are moving actually. in now. But you also mm -hmm. know that the French army are still in, 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 in Niger. Yes. Just yes. as the U.S. army is also, exactly. also still in Niger. Yes. Now, French is the major culprit in this. But they still have their army in, in Niger. So, so, so you see that if we want peace, then let's begin to think around peace. You mm -hmm. can't be saying you want peace. I am only saying why... Do you, uh, AU, your, your, your uh, postulation, who, who's we, AU, I'm talking of uh, uh, okay, uh, okay. African that suspended them. Okay. All right, maybe these are the facts. They are looking on ground to say, look, these guys are not even sincere. You are talking of democratic settlement. You are now making negotiations with Russian foreign That's powers nice. to come and fight on your behalf. Yeah. So what are we saying? We are saying that we don't want our people to fight, but we are getting ready for war. So what would you have done if... You have a military standby force mm -hmm. that was not taken off the table. Despite you, you embraced negotiation, mm -hmm. it was still placed on the table. Unfortunately, the, so the standby force is not just, standing anywhere. No, no, no. The standby force is not standing anywhere. Let me add. Okay. I, I listened carefully to the director of research of ECOWAS during the week. Mm -hmm. um, and then he said that, look, before now, they, they have all agreed at ECOWAS level to set up a standby That's force. That's what he's saying. Mm -hmm. Before now, mm -hmm. that this is actually a distraction mm -hmm. because it's now going to appear as though they are putting the force in place because of this. Okay. Okay. That they, they have before now agreed on a standby ECOWAS force mm -hmm. because of the issue of terrorism mm -hmm. and insurgency, you know, across the ECOWAS mm -hmm. region. Mm -hmm. So, and they had already started, you know, putting Put that in place. In place. In place yeah. What has happened in Niger? It just has just, you know, 
you know, now make, made it necessary for them to fast track the process. So was it needed so it in wasn't that communique because, it wasn't because dealing with the issue of the junta? Was it needed in that communique? To see that because it options. then gave a wrong impression yes. that, oh, it was because of Nigeria. they wanted to react. Yes. Probably, probably because they not included it. So they would have just let it, since it was an already, idea yeah, that, that they were already working the, the intervention in any of the case, I have not seen either news or pictures where there is actually in real sense an organized military formation standing by around no, the No, the, the, the defense chiefs of the various ECOWAS They states, just met. Ha, they have met and they have agreed. They have agreed uh, to modalities. Agreement. Agreed modalities meanwhile, to the, the, meanwhile the, the coup, uh, 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 these guys are already moving in forces. So who is ready if there's a word like that? Yeah, and I think we should be sympathetic with the military. Yes. Uh, with, the, with, the, with the coup leaders uh, in, in the circumstance. Because uh, in as much as they are citizens, they also have a right, you know, you know, but uh, we cannot uh, continue to allow ourselves to be ruled, you know, with, with guns. Mm. Uh, there has to be some level of uh, the people's, I mean, if you look at it, let people say this is what we want, whether the elections are flawed or not. I mean, over time it will, it will, it will get better. But let people have a sense of we are the ones who determine who leads us. Mm. Uh, that way, it's easy to hold them to account. Uh, you know that you really cannot just go and do any stupid protest in the name of uh, protest in the military regime. Mm -hmm. More like what we yes. do now that we yes. can just mm -hmm. march on the streets. You don't have your mind You can't anymore. even do that. Try it. You remember our experiences, you know, even in Try our... Try it. You know, <laughs> elsewhere where we have worked, where, you know, the military would... Do, in the, in the newsroom, mm -hmm. and they determine what goes on and what doesn't mm -hmm. go out. Oh, yes. And if you, even as a presenter, if you decide to say what you, what you wish to say, and the military leaders are not satisfied. They pick you up. Gentlemen, because of, of time, the, my, uh, one of my worries also is the fact that, sadly, uh, Africa uh, is, is behaving as a continent that never wants to have progress. Like you said, we keep having military incursion into mm -hmm. all those stuff. Africa behaves as if they never want progress, and we keep opening our doors for those who we felt we like, they really like us, but really they want to drag us back. I listened to the BRICS, uh, uh, this, this speech by Ramaphosa at the BRICS summit, yes. and they kept on saying that what Africa really wants is the fact that you want to come to develop Africa, you must be ready to build uh, your industries in Africa, Africa to develop those materials. That Africa is tired of exporting rocks and sand. What Africa wants to export are the finished product. products. So yes. if you're coming to mine the resources in Africa, be ready to build it's the facility to refine it. them, to refine our fuel, and we get the benefit of it. Not that we'll export our crude, and you come back, you keep the other byproduct to yourself. <laughs> and this is all we can take on the show today. <laughs> Gentlemen, thank you so much for being thank part of it. Much. Thank you. We we'll look forward to another opportunity much. next Definitely. time. And that is, bye for now. Issues in the news.